Hi, it's me. I know it's kind of early, but I just wanted to say hi on the um, first, well, no, this is the second day of Black History Month in 2011. I'm so excited, y'all, because this brings back so many wonderful memories. Less than two years ago, I wrote a play called See Our Inventions Everywhere. See Our Inventions Everywhere. <laughs> Mm, let's have some fries. Black history is all right. <laughs> Come on, everybody. The yarn benches everywhere. Mm, let's have some fries. Black history is all right. <laughs> all right, anyway, that was just a snippet. That came from the play. Um, it was a musical. It was for young audiences, and everybody enjoyed it. And I just want to do one of the songs from my play. It's my song. <clears throat> So all of y'all out there that might try to take it, I'm letting you know, watch it. This is my song. I wrote it, and um, and it's already copyrighted. All right. So with that being said, I want to share it with you guys so you guys can have a great day. This was, um, and, I, and you got to forgive me because I've it's been so long since I looked at the words. I have to look at the words while I sing the song, kind of. Um, and I'll do my best to do it uh, to the best of my ability because of course it is my song but I've had some people to sing it better um anyway so here it is this is a song that's about Madam C.J. Walker I know some of you guys are familiar with her um rumor has had it that she was the one who invented the straightening comb but that is untrue what she invented was a product that assisted the straightening comb or straightening products um things like the perm you know those kind of things came from her products and she had this product called Super Fine. Yeah, that was her first product, Super Fine. That's the one that made her a millionaire. Mm -hmm. She was one of the first women millionaires in her time. So I'm going to sing a little something for you guys. Um, and it's just a cute little bit, and I hope you enjoy it. Here we go. A Louisiana orphan, sad but true, washing clothes for a living. Making a dime or two. Women business owners, well, there were only a few. But it didn't stop what she was determined to do. No more look of distress. Divine suited us best. Madam C.J. Walk of May. Super fine. In 1905, she knew it was time for beautiful black women. She created a line, taught teams about beauty products made for us. She hit it big way before you heard of Oprah. No more look of distress, divine suited us best. Madam C.J. Walker made super fine, super fine, super fine. Super fine, super fine, super fine, super fine. Madam C.J. Walker makes super fine. Now this is the story I'm singing to you about a lady making things that she knew we could use. Hair softeners, perms, face powders, even straightening comb. She laid the foundation for us all to own. No more look of distress, divine suited us best. Madam C.J. Walker makes super fine. Super fine, super fine, super fine, super fine, super fine, super fine, Madam C.J. Walker May, super fine, yeah. <laughs> and you know what, this brings back so many memories, I actually performed that number for Madam C.J. Walker's great, great granddaughter. I am excited to share this with you, and I hope that you have a wonderful, wonderful day and continue to celebrate Black history as much as you can, not just during the month of February, but every day. Thanks, you guys, for your time, and I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> I sure did. <laughs> Until later, I miss you guys already. Take care.